Welcome to Hughes Creek, a sandbed stream in southeastern Australia. This lovely spot with its overhanging eucalypts is home to a family of echnomid caddisflies, like Cindy here. She just met Rob, her mate. It's quite a treat, as the mating ritual of these shy creatures remains something of a mystery. Having mated, Cindy must go in search of submerged bark upon which to lay her eggs. She enters the stream and goes from bark to bark. It's an important choice, as will have important ramifications for the survivorship of her offspring. Each egg mass may have hundreds of eggs in it. However, today we'll just follow the fate of one little larva, Mindy. Mindy's a predator. She'll build a silk retreat and rotate on other small invertebrates. Once she's collected enough energy, and when the time is right, she'll create a pupil case for herself. Inside, she undergoes metamorphosis and emerges in her adult form. She emerges from the stream and goes in search of a mate and habitat. So far, Mindy has found nothing but bare banks. There's no bark in the stream and no mate in sight. This stretch of stream has been cleared for grazing. Mindy must be getting tired by now. Has she made a fatal error, leaving her natal reach? Wait, just in time. This dapper young male sweeps Mindy off her wings. After this brief encounter, Mindy must go in search of bark to lay her eggs on. It looks like she's hit the jackpot here with so much bark. But wait, it looks as though Mindy's having trouble finding the preferred type of bark. She's going to have to, have to settle for second best. Let's hope it doesn't have severe consequences for her young. But wait, she's not alone here. There are hundreds of other females. Now laying thousands of eggs, it's a frenzy. What are the consequences for Mindy's offspring? Will they stay here and potentially compete with their family members? Will they strike out as she did in search of new habitat? If you want to find out what happens next, you'll have to stay tuned for the next ecological drama episode of Streamside Story.